hey guys welcome back to another tech tips and trick videos and in this video I'm gonna show you top 5 excel tips that will help you to in your daily life the first one is sum or addition of multiple numbers or two numbers and another one is average of numbers third one is VLOOKUP that also a most powerful excel function and another tax that can help to convert any numbers to tax or any date to weekdays and uh, another one is calculate of uh, two or more sale values in that so it will help you to merge the two sell values into one so let's get started subscribe take is 2.0 channel and press the bell icon to get a notification for new video so the first tip is about uh, sum uh, multiple numbers or two numbers so let's get so let's say I have a one sales report and this I'm I have to do a summation or addition of the units how many units are sold in this uh, sales report so what I will do so yeah and uh, there is a, a three ways to do some or addition of numbers so first first one is to do manual to type manually the formulas is equal to sum then the open brackets and uh, type the numbers or you can select the range of the uh, numbers like this and the uh, close brackets and press the enter key and you can see the uh, total of the how many units sold and another tips is here that auto sum and click on this auto sum and here you can see that it shows automatically uh, uh, populate this uh, formula with the range and press the enter yeah in here and another way is shortcut like uh, press the alter and equal to and yeah it sort of populate the sum and the range of the numbers that's it second tips is about uh, average of uh, numbers so let's say for example I in previous video we see the the, the total of the solid unit so here let's say total sold units and another column let's say uh, average unit sold so what I will do here is just we have to type the equal to then average here for the second one it's called average and press tab yeah and here you have to choose the range of the number close the bracket yes here you can see that average number is so the third of trips is a most powerful function in Excel and uh, if you know about this function then you will become an expert in the Excel to find uh, any numbers and the any values in from the large number of the records in the actual set so this is the function is about we look up so first of all you have to type the equal to and type the we look up and press the tab and first parameter you have to choose the look of value value which you when you want to uh, get the x the another value so first we have I want to know the price rate part rate from the uh, part ID so what I will do the I will pass the part ID value and another parameter is a table array so first so what I will do I will give the table array from the part ID to the part rate and select the range from these three columns and uh, another parameter is a call index num so uh, from uh, from which column you wants to want to the uh, value based on your weekly week lookup value okay so here the column number is uh, one two and three three is a part rate so here I will pass three and uh, last parameter is about uh, uh, approximate approximate match or exact match of the uh, lookup value here I will say that uh, exact exact match so I will pass false and here you can see that I have passed part ID is a uh, PT010 and the price rate is a uh, $32.64 so here you can see that you can tell you that this is how you can do that suppose I will pass another 12 and see it's passed it shows with a value of 
the rate so then the four tips is about to convert text from the any numbers and uh, in this uh, I will show you I will give the example of uh, convert uh, from the uh, day to weekdays here I want you you know that here I want to know about uh, uh, what was the day at the first step first September 2014 so what I will do here just I will type the equal to and the tax uh, press the tip and the value so select the column from where you wants to uh, select the uh, select the value where you wants to get the value to convert in the tax so here I will pass select the day of column b3 and then we have to give the format in the double inverted comma here I will format the text like I want full day name of the full days like uh, Mondays Tuesdays so here I will pass six time D and cross the bracket and press the enter and here you can say it's a Monday and yeah you can do with a flash fill like this and yes here you can see that's 17 June 2015 is a Wednesday 10 September 2014 is a Thursday like that you can convert the any number of the text and you have to give the format last but not the least trick and yeah it's very basic tricks and uh, very useful tricks in the Excel that you can merge two columns value or you can concatenate two values in single cell here I will I have a first name last name but I don't have a full name so what I will do I have to do a uh, full name from the last first name and uh, first name and last name so here I will do let equal to and then concat here this one and press the tip and I will give the first first name text one as a first name then comma then I will give bracket space and again comma and the select last name so it will give the first name com space then last name close the bracket press the enter here you can see that here we go you I got the full name thank you for the watching this video and if you like this video press the like, like button and comment your suggestion or any queries about uh, this tips and tricks and yeah if you are new to the take is 2.0 youtube channel please subscribe the button and press the bell icon to get notification for the new video whenever i post new videos in my channel